What's up everybody, not Dark Wolf here, and today, as you can see, we're continuing right where we left off. Uh, marching through Sen's fortress, we just got Big Hat Logan. Logan in the new episode 5, it, it's not the original one. In the original one, it was corrupted beyond being able to save it. And don't, don't worry though, we're, we are going to kill this mimic eventually, probably, maybe, I don't know. I don't know if we're gonna eventually be killing this mimic, that mimic. All I know is that it's gonna be after we defeat Ornstein and Smo. Oh, the Anderlon, the Anderlondo bros. Runway. All right. So this one's a bit of a tricky one. But really, you just roll past it. did in the last video can be super easy. You can also carry them for a lot more damage. I just remember that. Basically that's how I kill them a lot. These guys I just burn. It does a lot more damage in, in that than it does to anything else. Because those guys are the ones that can cast lightning and they do a lot less damage and they take they take a lot more damage. Ah shoot. You know, as you can see that's why I wanted to save up my fireballs. And also, you can stand right there. Yeah, that's a thing. It probably should it be. No, probably not. Is it anyway? Yeah, it is. And then also, this thing exists. So, you know, that's really what I want to. Showcases so that way it's like the hidden bonfire locations so you can know them And also we're, we're already well over the amount of strength and dex that Quailex Fury Sword needs I think it's only like 12 strength and 16 dex that you need So yeah, um, we're just gonna be getting more attunement slots if we can which we can so Yeah, vitality it is or uh, actually, hold up. Endurance. Hmm. How much extra health do we get? Okay, so we'd be put into 800 if we got that. You know what? We're getting more endurance because, because the dragon, because quite let, because the dragon headstone. Owns fire breath if you can hold it, and but it requires a lot more stamina to do so. Or shoot, um, we're gonna be quickly running back there because I forgot to become human. I just want to grab that really. You know, it's basically like, take the plunge, you won't die, nice sort of thing. But if you don't take the plunge and you reach here, you will die. We're not kindling this bonfire. Because there's no, there's no warp to this bonfire. 
and it's not and it is the boss bonfire but there's an easy summon that you can just get to kill the boss so much easier just to get him and it's an NPC summon at that for those of you who don't know oh its name is Iron Tarkus Or really, his name, his guy, Black Black Iron Tarkus. We get his stuff at a later date. Hey, trust me. Once his quest line is complete. There's off boulder. Yeah, that's why we don't mess with the giants here. But, um, we're gonna be doing just that, because we need to kill that thing and the firebomb giant up above. But yeah, no, right here's Iron Tarkus's spawn. He uses black iron everything. Which, by the way, is super heavy, because I have a build base around it that uses it. Head low, Iron Tarkus. Let's go. Oh, and by the way, if you hear me, like, doing anything, it's because I am currently, well, allergies, really. That's really why. So, you know, come on, Iron Tarkus. You know, dodge that attack if you can. Iron Tarkus, he can bring the beating to this guy. See what I mean? We already killed him, and you could see how easy that was. Titanite Junk, I'll need that later. Alright. Now's time for the big battle. So, guys. This creature is, is the Iron Golem. He's also very much fire resistant. That, that's it. That's his intro attack. If you want immediately run for it. You know, let Iron Tarkus do most of the work. Because I just see how much damage Iron Tarkus is doing just here. And, um, ah, oh, shoot, how dare you survive? But yeah, you can see, even with my, my fire magic, is doing my fire damage, my magic is doing damage there. Alright, core of the iron golem. Oh, by the way, that firebomb giant does not respawn, while the boulder giant down there, yeah, right down there, see him, he's the one dropping all the boulders at first. He does respawn. He's not worth killing. Because then you also can't get back. Alright, and basically, basically some dudes carry you up here and welcome to the city of the gods. Anolando. And also there's two gargoyles here. So yeah, meet old friends. Don't forget to meet your old friends along the way. <laughs> Semi old friends, really. So, yeah, um, there's actually a. If you're asking me why I didn't run down to go upgrade my sword, it's because. Well, I don't want everything to respawn, and also. I just don't want it. I mean, like, there's a blacksmith up here, what's the point? Alright, so, um. Alright, so I'm gonna get up to that and then we're going to put some more things in vitality because it's going to get really annoying if we don't have enough vitality to survive all these attacks that we're gonna be having to deal with. Let's see, attuned magic, iron flesh. I mean, like, 
yes, I have five attunement slots, but Chaos Magic takes up some. Takes up two. Alright, and, um, we're going to be ending this here. That's right.